Hello everyone and welcome. My name is Clara and I work at the Idea Store in Whitechapel and today I'm here for our Idea Store Storytime Online. And you are all welcome to join us every day at half past 10, Monday to Saturday. And what we do, we read or present some books and we sing a story. And today I have two very good books that I'm very excited about. One is a, a fairly classic book of uh, rhymes and the other one is a brand new, brand new, just out book. So the first book we're going to have a look at is Mother Goose's Playtime Rhymes by Axel Scheffler and I'm presenting it with permission of Macmillan Children's Books. So what is good about this book is that there is a story with Mother Goose that goes through the whole book and you can read it, it's quite a long story but every now and again through the story there is a song to sing so today we are going to sing one song from this book and we are going to have all the words for it just there because it's in the book and this song is called the grand old duke of york Yes, the Grand Old Duke of York. Do you know this song? If you don't know it, we can learn it all together and we've got the words just over there. Okay, are we ready? And you can also stand up and you can march. You ready? One, two, me and you. Oh, the Grand Old Duke of York, he had 10,000 men, he marched them up to the top of the hills and he marched them down again. And when they were up, they were up. And when they were down, they were down. And when they were only halfway up, they were neither up nor down. Well done. It's quite a military one, isn't it? Yeah, should we try again? Okay. Ready? One, two. Me and you. Oh, the Grand Old Duke of York. He had 10,000 men. He marched them up to the top of the hill and he marched them down again. And when they were up, they were up. And when they were down, they were down. And when they were only halfway up, they were neither up nor down. Well done. Very good. All of the other songs in this book are all very classic and traditional. For example, there is so another one that I knew. Baba Black Sheep is another one. Little Miss Muffet is another one. And it's just a very classic book. The other book that we are going to read today is very new, just out. It's called Egg and it's by Sue Hendra and Paul Linnet and again thanks and permission from Macmillan Children's Books. Egg. 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 Egg, egg, oh, oh, egg, huh? egg, egg, <laughs> egg. Hmm. Egg, egg, oh, oh, egg, <laughs> egg, oh, <laughs> egg, ah, <laughs> egg, oh, oh, egg, oh, egg. Egg, 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 
Oh, egg. Egg. Oh. That is the end of our story. I do like those stories with very few words. There is another couple of them. One is called banana. One is called hog. They are very good for very little children because they can more or less read them themselves. So I hope you enjoyed it too. And I hope you can join us again for some more story time here on the YouTube channel, Idea Store Story Time. Don't forget to uh, subscribe to the channel and to like the videos that you enjoy. Thank you very much. Bye bye.